Yeah, really. So Asia Pulpin paper has come up with the massive investment in the Maharashtra with the large and big capacity of the right printing. So what uh, what impact do you calculate on the market dynamics because of this big capacity in the Indian markets? One, I think uh, India is a growth story. So India is going to grow in terms of consumption, including of paper, packaging, tissue, and all kinds of paper products. So uh, one way, one way, whenever uh, you know uh, foreign players have come into India, the domestic industry sometimes you know gets worried. What is going to happen to us? and how is the market, market share going to change, etc. But I think it's also good because it will bring you more competitiveness in the domestic industry. And I hope that the new players also invest in plantations and create a good employment and with sustainable kind of practices. So I think it's going to make the industry very vibrant and uh, competitive. So as is writing printing paper, companies, manufacturing companies are already, uh, already facing the demand crisis. And such a demand uh, come in the, such a capacity come in the market. How will you see the market in the next five years? Sir? See, the demand crisis is temporary, even if it is so. In some segments, of paper, we are not seeing so much of demand, uh, you know, con contraction. Uh, and uh, see, we are looking at any of these new investments will take around four to five years to actualize, right? So I think consumption will grow, the demand will grow, and India is also an opportunity to export to a lot of countries. So I think whatever investments that we have done or the industry has done in India, I don't think will go wasted. What pricing scenario do you see in writing So that we will not comment. Sir, so there is a recession prediction in 2023. Yes. So how do you see this recession? It will impact on Indian paper industry or not? See, whenever there is a recession, it will impact the entire globe. But we believe, based on a lot of economics, they are saying that India may not go through such kind of recessionary impact and India is quite resilient. So that extent, Indian India, even if India faces some uh, headwinds, it will be minor. And I think we will spring back. Any new updates are in ITC, in product, for, product portfolio or anything? Yeah, we are focused a lot on the plastic, plastic substitution products. We already have a huge list of portfolio of products and we are going to scale them up in the coming years. So do you think the single-use plastic brand really benefits the paper industry because most of the players like we talked to Badamji also they are not satisfied with the single use plastic ban and they are not getting the actual benefit from that yeah it will take time see these are very disruptive changes right uh, the way enforcement happens in some countries enforcement may not be so effective here today so I think it will uh, it is beyond the regulations I think also a lot of end users consumers customers if they are also committed to this action probably the change will happen but we believe that change will happen it will take longer so last year government implement the paper import monitoring system and yeah. the uh, trader bodies also seeking this as a curb on yes. the paper import. Yeah. So how how do you take this he, their stand? That is it, it is really curb for them? Uh, I think it is largely it is helping the industry. So uh, it should be removed or it should not no, be. No, the I mean system as as an association, IPMA has been uh, asking this uh, you know for a long time. So we are happy that uh, that has been implemented. So are you in packaging also, sir? We are largely in packaging. Packaging. Yeah. Yes, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Thank, Thank you so much. Thanks.